This is Lars Christensen of Census. What I'll do is uh, I'll explain briefly how you can convert uh, a document in PDF format into a DAISY file. So what I did was that I started out uh, by converting the PDF file into a text document. Um, it looks like uh, something like this. We can see there's a table of contents. Uh, there's some uh, initial wording about the book, some, some, uh, some front matter stuff. And then eventually we get to the first real chapter of the document, the introduction here. So, so I uh, I saved the uh, the text file and loaded it in uh, in Word. So let's see. Um, so here we have the document in uh, in in Word format. What you can see is that I removed uh, the table of contents, all of that, that will be automatically regenerated uh, by the DAISY converter. What I also did was I added some uh, metadata to the document, uh, the title, the authors, and the publisher of the document. I then went through the document, I marked up the different headings. This is a heading at level one, this is a heading at, uh, at level two. You may want to consult the original uh, table of contents of the of the source document in order to find out exactly the heading levels. This is another heading at level two. This is a heading at level three. Um, let's see if we have any more. Um, yeah, this is another level, level three heading, and so on. Um, eventually, I saved the document as uh, a docx file. I then went on to upload the document for conversion using census access. Uh, what I did was um, let's see. I went to the book conversions here. Uh, I went and found the document. In this case, my document is called uh, Taught Doctrine in Practice Example One. Um, I uploaded that document. Uh, we can then see that we get two different DAISY options. Uh, what I did was I selected actually the DAISY math full text full audio option, not because there's math in the document, because uh, but because when you select this option, you're using a more modern and more efficient DAISY uh, conversion workflow. Um, lastly, I typed in my email address so that the uh, system will know where to return the result and submit the job. What I get back from the service um, and go and have a look at it. Um, is uh, is this file? We can see it says uh, raw braille result of the days of conversion of torch doctrine and practice example one. Uh, the document has been translated into days in math, and there's then there's a link here to a zip file. I download that zip file, and then I go and open the uh, the zip file in uh, a daisy player. In this case, I'll just use the Dolphin Easy Player. What you can see is that uh, a table of contents have been, has been uh, generated automatically from the document that I've submitted. Also, there's uh, the different headings. This is, is the, the level one heading we had before. This is the level two heading we had. And also, if we go through the document, we will see there's another level two heading. Here's a level three heading. So when you see it, it corresponds to the different heading levels in the table of content. So, uh, I can then go and play the Preparing document. Preparing for and being prepared for law school classes may be different from what you had to do to be successful in the past. At the risk of being too basic, this is because there are always different possible degrees of preparedness. You can be entirely unprepared because you didn't read the assignment. You can be partially prepared because you only read a portion of the assignment, although you did that carefully. So you can pause it. You can move to a specific section of the document. A the increasing role of legislatures. When politicians and commentators talk about activist judges who overstep their bounds by making rather than in... So converting the document into uh, a DAISY file will produce a DAISY document that is much easier to navigate for a student uh, compared to, say, if you convert it into a plain MP3 file. Of course, you need to do a bit of markup in the beginning, um, but it only, I, I, I took the first uh, one and a half chapters, about uh, 50 pages, and it took me about half an hour to do that. So it's definitely curable.